Good afternoon. As you heard, I happen to be working with the Blue Green Alliance, and I'm national co-chair along with former Congressman Mark Schauer on our Jobs 21 initiative. And you all are a key part of making sure that we're putting Americans back to work. Are you ready to do that? Yeah. Now we need a real job plan that's going to build the jobs and the industries of the future. The right right now seems to have one kind of plan. It's a firing plan. What we want is a hiring plan, right? Yeah. We need to be building and maintaining and creating good American jobs right here, not in China, not in India, right here at home. And big part of that is going to be about rebuilding and modernizing our infrastructure, our transportation infrastructure, as the mayors both talked about with our bridges and our highways. We know that we can relieve our congestion and move our people and our goods and services. What you might not know is right now we are wasting about four billion gallons of oil a year by congestion and we are wasting a billion gallons a day that we could be transforming if we actually modernize our infrastructure. So it's time to get our transportation put back on the right track. Obviously it'll help us with for those who don't even use cars, right? It'll help everybody and move America forward. Now in addition to that, we know we have another infrastructure. For many of us, I know we got a lot of us here from greater Minnesota, we know that our water infrastructure has been failing as well, right? We know that if we want to make sure that we can continue to have safe and clean drinking water, we need to make those investments now, create those good jobs, and make sure that we're moving forward. Every day, seven billion gallons of clean drinking water are lost to leaking pipes. Now this might kind of sound kind of gross, but in addition, every year we have 850 billion gallons of sewage overflow. We can stop that. We need to for the future. We need that to make sure that we can continue our great Minnesota tradition of hunting and fishing. Now, the last great generation built our infrastructure, right? It's up to us to step up to the plate and modernize and rebuild it. It's going to create good American jobs while ensuring we're leaving a better environment for our children and grandchildren. So I ask you, is it time for us to get our jobs back? Yeah.